Well, I've made a movie in iMovie, and now it's time to get it onto my computer. It was not simple, so let me show you how. Here's the movie that I would love to get on my computer. This is How to Open a Bottle of Champagne. We're going to share this, which is this little icon. And we're going to save video. That's a square with the arrow again. Next option you'll get is high resolution or medium resolution. Um, you can make any of these choices. We are going to go with the highest possible just because we can. It's exporting now and that means it's putting it into a different kind of format that we're going to be able to actually transfer out. So that loading process took about a minute and now it has told us it's been exported to the photo library so that's where we're headed next. Click OK. So I'm clicking back here to get back to my main screen and I'm looking for my photo app, which is the one with the color wheel, photos. Okay, so here it is, and we're going to go ahead and play, make You've sure it's the one we want. Event, and mm -hmm. you need to open mm -hmm. a bottle of champagne. In this video, I'm going to go okay, through. Okay, so now that we know our video is here on our phone, uh, we want to transfer it to our computer now. So I'm going to use this cable. This is a, looks like a charger for the phone here. Stick it in there, and then it's connected to the USB port on my laptop. And now I am going to my, uh, actually I'm going to close this, go to my file browser, select Apple phone the same window we were just in. You can get to it either way. And when I do that, I come back to my phone, it says I need to give permission. I need to allow them to access or allow the devices to access the photos. So that's what we did. Now when I come back to my file browser, I see Apple phone in the list here click on that. Now when I click on internal storage, it sees the photos inside. Just keep, keep clicking deeper and deeper and you will see all kinds of photos and videos. So I've got a pretty long list of uh, photos and videos here. I could just hunt and peck, but I'm instead going to use this search box. Clicking on it gives me the option to search by date modified, or if I know the title, there's other filters you can use. So I'm going to go with the date modified because we just did this. Okay, so right here is the one I want. I'm gonna click on it, and make sure it really is the video about opening a bottle of champagne. We'll let it think for a moment. It's working hard for us, so we are not complaining. And we'll just confirm this is the right video. Would want to send the wrong video to the wrong person. It's worth the if wait. You've got that special event, and you need to open a bottle of champagne. In this video, I'm going to go through. So that is how you take your edited movie from your phone and transfer it to your computer. And the secret is this cable going directly into your computer. This is the charge cable I use all the time. And going to the photo app and saving it to file. And then you're set and you can do whatever you want from your computer a lot easier. Hope you enjoyed this video. Hope it helps. If you have other tips, you can post them below. Thanks.